Hey everybody, how you doing? This is Clint. I'm an artist from Austin, Texas, and I have a fun art project for us today. Um, <clears throat> recently, I got a little challenge from some of my art friends. Uh, they said, Clint, we want to see what you can do with some uh, just industrial foam. Stuff that you can get from like a regular hardware store. So I said, okay, I accept that challenge. I think I can do that. Now, I have been working a little bit with this foam, kind of making some layered paintings. Maybe you've seen them in some of my other videos. But for this one, I kind of went completely loco. I kind of feel like I fell into something that's pretty interesting and fun. Like, uh, I kind of wasn't even expecting it, but I think you'll dig it. So, let's get into this art making project. Let's have some fun. All right, let's do this. And like I said, I really didn't even know what I was doing. I kind of drew the shape out on the foam and kind of drew these organic shapes inside of it. And I literally used just like a, a little knife from the, the kitchen drawer. Nothing, nothing crazy. And I just started carving these shapes and um, one by one. And I think they kind of look pretty cool. Now something I might do in the future is I might come back and take a little sandpaper to these. And then I thought initially I was going to throw away that shape, that first shape, but I, I just thought it would look really cool inside of there. And then I kind of started to make a background. I wanted, I, I felt there should be some more movement in the background. So I got outside, got a little experimental, poured some paint on here, kind of this gray paint and just kind of like let it move around um, I really didn't know what I was doing but just having fun with the process like I said this was, this whole painting was a complete experiment and without much thought I just put that shape right on there and used the the paint as glue and then inside of these things I, I did I wanted to come back and paint these those shapes that I cut out so I tried to do a grayscale um I went you, can, you can't really tell, but there's two different scales of gray there. So it's like a three black, dark gray, and a light gray. So here you have it. I call it man and woman. I see the woman kind of on this side right here. And the man kind of on that side and they're kind of like sharing the same brain and uh, it was super fun to carve these shapes out and I think I'm on the whole new art process. Rock and roll.